we have me a water that's in my fridge. Oh my god, with the attitude. With the attitude. This kid, let me tell you, oh he god. is one of the many situations going on in my... To get that service. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel, or maybe I should be saying welcome back because you girls been in my for uh, two months. I mean, should we really say into the math because it's been some time. Like, if we go back and look at the time where I post my last video, like real legit video. Yeah. So. Anyways, um, you're probably not even wondering or caring why I've been gone. Nah, but I have been. Um, and I guess I honestly don't really have the best reason or even a fairly good reason to explain why or what's been going on. Um, but regardless, I'm going to go ahead and attempt to explain some of the things that have been going on and what I've been getting myself into and um, just my absence. And hopefully this will be my welcome back to YouTube video, which kind of feels a little bit weird to be making today because I just spent the past two hours watching news footage about the shooting that just happened in YouTube headquarters, and I'm not completely updated <clears throat> on it right now because um, the news changed over and everything, and thankfully it wasn't as bad of a situation as it could have been. So far, all I've heard was that one person has died, and that was the um, suspect right now, who is a woman, and that's crazy. <coughs> Sorry about the voice today, guys. Uh, I am just getting over being sick, and I lost my voice, and uh, your girl got croup. I would like to thank my two-year-old niece for uh, giving that to me, because who gets croup? Who gets croup, guys? Like... Clearly you. I'm sorry. When was the last time that anybody turned around and said, Huh, I have the flu. Nah, not me. I got a cold. Oh, it's cool, guys. I got croup. But, like, your girl gets croup. So, thank you, Des. I'm gonna love you forever. But, like, I will definitely get this one back to you later on in life, okay? Just croup. Really? So, yeah. That sucked. Um, but... Uh, so your, my voice is a little bit eh, but we're getting over that. It's cool. We're good. We're happy. Um, so yeah, posting this. Um, I made this video probably two dozen times in different locations, different spots, and none of them have felt legit enough to post. So this is just going to be it. Whatever this is, this is going to be it. Um... <clears throat> I honestly think it's been like since September that I've tried to make videos and they just don't feel authentic. They don't feel like I'm being me. They feel like I'm just like putting out bullshit and I'm not going to post that. I've done a lot of like little clips like between September and March of different things that I'll definitely put together in a video if you guys want to see that stuff. Um, okay, so... One of the many things that I have, and probably the most major thing going on in my life right now, is that I went back to school. I went back to school. I am currently in grad school. I am going for my master's in special education and elementary um, licensing thing. I'm getting my initial license for teaching, and that is taking up probably 90% of my time. So, if you are somebody in my very personal life, and I haven't been answering your text messages or phone calls and we haven't been hanging out, that's why. And I'm sorry, but that's why. Um, literally, homework has taken over my life, okay? Like, it's crazy. But it's good. I'm loving it. I'm going to school on campus. My campus is gorgeous. I'm taking classes over the summer. And um, they're, like, updating the, like, student union. And it's just great. It's been probably one of the most positive changes I put into my life within the past six months or seven months. So like, yeah, that's that's been pretty awesome. 
Um, but that's definitely taken over, like, almost all of my time. What happened? It's completely solid. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just a completely solid that's color. That's so weird. I know, right? So who else thought that the slime trend was going to die in 2017? It ain't gonna nope. die. It's still alive, apparently. But oh my god, this is really liquidy. Anyways, um, so I quit my job at Edible Arrangements, which also has been a really positive change in my life. No hate, no tea, no shade. Just a really positive change. Um, it was definitely in due time, for sure, I have to say that. I will always have the most respect and love for the owners who I worked for and my manager at the time. Um, but you know what? It just, it was, it was starting to become a chore. Like, that's just not where my heart was anyways. I enjoyed it. I loved it. I had fun. And I kept the same crew for an entire year. And that was amazing. Like, I had the two most amazing girls there. Um, we ended up becoming really good friends. And seriously, they were amazing. I would do anything for them still to this day. And I know that they would do the same for me. And actually, one of them is going to be my cousin at some point in the future. So, shout outs to Marisha. Really? But you know, it had been more than a year since I would gotten a raise. And, um, my girls needed more hours, and I was being told to cut hours, and nobody can live off of 15 hours a week, honestly. And it just was becoming a really hard, I don't know, it just, you know what, it just, it was money, period. I needed more money, I, my girls needed more money, and I felt like I was no longer being appreciated there. And it's hard to work for somebody or work for a place that you don't feel appreciated and where you just feel like, why am I doing this if nobody's really noticing anymore? And again, I love the people I worked for. I would totally work for them again. Like if they needed something or if they needed help over the holidays, I would still go back. But I do have to say it was amazing to have Christmas to myself again this year. It, that was nice. But I would still totally be there for them. I just couldn't see myself getting stuck in a job where I wasn't getting paid. There's no room to move up. Um, it just, it didn't make sense. So, uh, no issues though. I would still totally recommend anybody like starting out with a job or like early 20s, right out of high school kind of thing. Um, it's a good place to work. Go for it. And honestly, like go get their products it's still great I still I spend my money to go get the product there because I still love it so yeah like totally recommend definitely but it was a good change so yeah on that note um right now I have been spending every single day of my life <laughs> for the past like month and a half with either my nephew or my niece or a combination of the two. Um, my nephew ten, my nephew comes over five days a week now. After school, we do homework together. We hang out together. It's been a really awesome uh, past month or two, actually. Like three. Like yeah, it's been actually it's been a while. Um, he he started this last being. Last video you up updated. Yeah, he started being a bonehead, and we had to fix it. And I feel like. We are on the right path towards that. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Um, and then my niece, come, like, we watch my niece four days a week. Which you guys will see in upcoming vlogs. So, yeah, other than that, I don't really have that many updates. My life has been kind of boring. Um, my best friend got knocked up. Huge update there, actually. She's having a little boy. So, I'm gonna be an auntie again. Which is amazing, because honestly, like, she deserves it better and more than anybody else I know. Like, she's going to be the most phenomenal mom, and I can't wait for her to have her son. Yeah, guys, like, that's pretty much my life right now. Taking care of kids and teenagers and doing school. I guess just let me know what you guys want to see. 
I was thinking about doing videos, like updated videos of things I've done in the past. Um, and I'll probably do either bi-weekly or weekly vlogs. Definitely can't even commit to every day because my life is not exciting enough whatsoever. Like, no. If you guys are interested in that. And I hope you guys are uh, very forgiving. So, that's that. Everything else, we're just going to take it one day at a time. Because there's just so much going on in this world that I can't even begin to fathom. So, one day at a time. Alright guys. One day at a time. <laughs> If you like this video and if you are excited to see my face again, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Um, I don't promise that there'll be exciting videos, but I promise to upload more. And I will put together some of the other footage from the past six months. Um, that way you guys can at least see a little bit of what's been going on. And I will see you guys here in a couple days. I hope you're having a wonderful one. And... Uh, yeah, is that that's that's how we end these things, right? Yeah. I think that's how we end them. I <laughs> it's not service with a smile, <laughs> but it's service. <laughs>